Hey kittens, welcome to the video. You know the routine. We're gonna watch Frugal Daddy do some amazing dumpster diving at one of our very favorite Aldi dumpsters. It's the dumpster that very rarely disappoints. We have a, this is, I, this is, this is pretty close to being a mega haul. This is like a really big, big load of groceries. So let's watch Frugal Daddy dive and I'll meet you back here in a sec. I left my light in the car. Is that enough light? Fine. Don't be the garbage truck. Anyway, I'm at Aldi, and it's early, but not that early. So people might be showing up, so I'm a little nervous. <gasps> whoa, whoa. Good stuff, good stuff. I'm excited. Let's go.
All righty, we've got all the food arranged on the table, en plein air, as we like to say en français, meaning, you know, outside in the fresh air. Plus, I have to remember to show you the Halloween decorations, which we brought inside. Super, super cute. Totally worth the whole everything. All of it. All of it. Here we go. We have three 12 inch cauliflower crust uncured pepperoni pizzas. Those look pretty yummy. We've got veggies for steaming. It's your California medley, which appears to be your broccoli, cauliflower, carrot combo. We've also got Asian seasoned medley. A little more variety in there. We've got a two pound bag of confectioner's sugar and a pretty generous package there of sage, which is the smell of stuffing coming up into the Thanksgiving season. If you wanna make any stuffing from scratch, make sure you've got your dumpster sage. All right, we've got three bags of gala apples that all look fantastic. We've got three little individually wrapped ton of chocolate, which also look fantastic. We've got three Parmesan cheeses. I had them popped open before. I can't do anything one-handed. Eh. I had them all open before to show you that they all have their safety seals intact. We've also got some raspberry jam. I love raspberry jam. We have a package of cream cheese. There's your best by date next May. We've got your little grape tomatoes, strawberries, kiwi, two bags of limes, and a bag of romaine hearts. A big farmer's sack full of onions. Three packages of cut cantaloupe, bananas, portobello mushroom caps, beautiful yellow, orange, and red peppers, potato chips, two zucchinis, We've got a tube of biscuit dough. We've got chicken broth, and there are my Dollar General watering buckets. We have your Big Dippers tortilla chips, which would be great with that dip. The other day, the Greek yogurt, everything bagel flavored dip that I have highly touted. Just excellent stuff, excellent, excellent. We've got Chicorn Dogarinos. We've got eggs. Eggs. Glorious eggs! We've got the Brahma potato and cheddar pierogies. Daddy loves those. Oh, look, you could My have favorite. them with the mixed uh, California veg. Right? Yeah. That's how they picture it. Potato puffs. Those french fries the other day in the toast, not the toaster oven. What's that thing called? Air fryer. Air fryer. I was going to say they were delicious. I didn't try them, but they looked delicious. Yeah. Did you know that air fryer was free? We found of that. Of course it was free. Yeah. Um, did you try the french fries? Yeah, oh yeah, they're awesome. So, okay, so these potato puffs probably also will be. Yes. All right. It's, it's, it has a lot to do with the, um, air with, with the air fryer. Yeah. We have, what, some sort of Disney thing. That's my dad. 100th um, anniversary? Celebrate, what is it? His 100th birthday, I think. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walt, is it Walt? No, he's got to have been older than 100, like, years ago. Maybe the Disney Corporation. All right. Anyway, we have a Disney's 100th something or other going on, and we've got a lot of our Disney heroines here. And this popcorn is apparently less evil than oh. Cruella de Vil and Jafar and Scar. Premium. What is going on here? Premium quality, minimally processed celebration popcorn, sweet and salty with organic olive oil. Mm -mm. Sweet yes, and salty, please, you know dumpster. It's, yeah, it's going to be um, yummy. Uh, kettle corn, I bet. The lesser of many evils. We've got two packages of your thinly sliced chicken breasts. What is this, pork? This is yeah. a big old hunk of pork. Look at the date on that. 11-10. Pork tenderloin. You what know are we saying? It is you know a family pack. You know it's bad when this is a family pack. I know. Well, it's not a big family. Yeah. Um, and we've got your cheddar brats, which Frugal Daddy, I think... Likes. likes. Yeah, I was going to say loves, and I'm like, well, I, don't think it's a, I don't think it's a love affair with them, but I think it's a like. All right, here we go with the Halloween decorations. We have this tassel garland, which we are hanging in front of the fireplace. 
Not the pom-pom garland. That was from Walmart on sale after Halloween a couple years ago. But yes, we have the tassel garland. And we have Halloween bats. Mercia Lagos Day Halloween. Three pieces, large bats measuring blah, blah, blah. And five pieces, small bats measuring blah, blah, blah. Indoor, outdoor, covered use only comes ready to mount on the wall. Bats. They're very cute. They, look, they have a mounting dealio on the back to hang on the wall. They look like a Batman bat. They are plastic, but they kind of look like wood, if you know what I mean. Kind of, sort of. There's the mama bat, and there's the daddy bat. The cat is looking at the bats. There's a baby bat. And another baby bat. Let's say it all together. Mercy Lago. Oh, that one's got like some kind of dumpster juice on it. What is it, kitty? It's like, I don't know. We'll deal with that. Another baby bat. Here you go. Kitty wants the bat. So it looks like we've got the full shebang. We've got three big bats. And five little bats. I really like these. I think these are very fun. Oh, kitty cat. This is a really nice, colorful, successful dumpster haul and fabulous dive. This is just, like, this is a lot of great food. This is a, just a lot of food. Yes. It's just a lot of food, Frugal Mommy. Is that what you're trying to say? Yeah. Yes, I am. I almost forgot to show you the pedal yes. exerciser. Well, there you go. I was watching. That's what it is. Pedal it and pedal it. Pedal your way to health. We're thinking that this was a return. Someone got this home. And Would you like me to open it? If you want to open it, sure. I cut my toe the other day in the kitchen, and I think um, it's getting gangrene, and I'm yeah. wondering if you can cut it off and cauterize it, because well, I can't you, afford to go to the doctor. I, yeah, and you might rehab with this. I sure, can show sure. you. I mean, that looks pretty darn yeah. new, doesn't it? It looks yeah. all shiny and Star Trek-y. Yeah. Cool. This looks like a pedal. Mm -hmm. Or not. Or, oh, yeah. no, it's that front thing. Mm -hmm. Front thing. Yeah, the pedals don't look like that at all for little mommy. There's another front thing. Oh, that must be the back thing. I think that's the front thing and the other thing is the back thing. Well, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I bet you can get all that put together in about five seconds and off you'll go. As if yes. you are riding in the Tour de France again. Well, thanks for watching Frugalises and Dumpstrinas. I hope you enjoyed your dumpster dive with Frugal Daddy and seeing the food all spread out there for you, for your viewing enjoyment. So... Good job, Frugal Daddy. All right, we will see you again soon in our next dumpster diving video. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, ring that bell. Give us a comment, leave us a thumbs up, share this video on all possible forms of social media or any type of human communication available. And say hi to Wally and Lisa, and we'll see you again soon. So we hope that you keep diving, keep Driving, keep flying, keep subscribing, keep staying alive, and keep high fiving. All right, there we go. Frugal Daddy has his new little exercise uh, toe physical therapy. Though I, I have it backwards so you can see the, uh, the this numbers. monitor thing. Mm -hmm. So this would peel off and. Does it need batteries, I assume? Or you generate the energy it needs to give the digital readout. That would be cool. You can attach it to the toaster so you can power. Just attach it to the oven so I can. Heat up your pizza? pizza. Heat your dumpster pizza? That the cauliflower crust, uncured mm, pepperoni dumpster pizza? It's your fave, isn't it? Look at that. And it's giving you the energy you need. Yeah. You're also bouncing that chair around.